Hey guys, we've got another opening video today. Hold on, I can't get out of the way. Alright, so we've got a pack of Yu-Gi-Oh! High Speed Riders, Pokemon XY Breakthrough, and the 2015 World Championships deck, the Jacob Van Wagner Honor Stoice deck. It says Jacob Van Wagner won the Masters Champion Tournament. So, let's open the Yu-Gi-Oh! first. Still trying to get those new Red Dragon Archfiend things, so let's hope they're in here. Speedroid Double Yo-Yo. Silent Psychic Wizard. Hushed Psychic Cleric. Psy Frame Overload, Speedroid Terror Top, well, those were our rares, didn't get the Red Dragon stuff, Speedroid Menko, Resonator Call, Serene Psychic Witch, and Expressroid, oh nice, I needed him. Alright, so it looks like I got a good bit of Psychic stuff for a deck I'm working on. Resonator Call for my Jack Atlas deck, and Express Roid for my GX deck. I may or may not make videos on any of those. Looks like Konami's trying to tell me to run Speed Roids, but I'm not even going to bother with them. They're really weird. Alright, let's open Pokemon Breakthrough. I don't understand what exactly a Pokemon Break is, but Let's hope I get one just so I can figure it out. We got Starly, Finnegan, Flabebe, yet more excuses for me to need fairy energy, Sandshrew, Cubone, Frogadier, nice, I was actually planning on buying him. Semi Sage. Mewtwo Spirit Link. Now I need Mewtwo EX and Mega Mewtwo EX. Looks like one of these cards is going to confuse me. Fracture. Now I need Axew. And Parallel City. It's got a right side up and an upside down. What? Choose which way this card faces before you play it. When pointing down this... When... Uh, shoot. This pointing down player can't have more than three bench Pokemon. When this card comes into play, this player discards bench Pokemon until he or she has... Uh, choose which way this card faces before you play it. Any damage done by attacks from this player's Grass, Fire, or Water Pokemon is reduced by 20 damage before applying Weakness and Resistance. Okay, so apparently this means whichever player that side is facing at. I can see that being very useful. So, let's review our foil was Frogadier. I think I've noticed that Pokemon packs are always having foils now, so that's, that's really cool. Foils and rares, because Semi Sage is a rare. Gotta think if I have Hand Sage. Huh. Well, anyway, I've got good starts for more decks. And now let's look at the World Championship deck. There's a deck list on the back, but I'm gonna I'm gonna show you the individual cards. All right, let's see what we've we've got this. Apparently, this is a deck list for all of the. Oh, it's tournament standings and the deck list for the first through third place of all of the 
different tournaments. I was going to get the deck that had Primal Groudon, but it just didn't come with as much stuff that I wanted. Since I have the deck list now, though, I can get what I can just buy singles of whatever I need. Some of these decks don't look bad. All right, let's let's look at what came in this. We get a 2015 Boston Pikachu pin. A deck box, apparently with half the deck inside. It's nice and sturdy. How do we get you out? Okay, like that. Oh, I think you're excellent looking. Um, let's pop it all out somehow. All right. Flipping cards everywhere. Oh, they don't just have the World Championship back. They have really cool silver frames. Alright, let's just get straight into this and see what we get. Keldeo EX. Alright, just wanted to let you know these are not tournament legal, but I'm sure as long as you use sleeves on them because of the World Championship back, it should be fine for casual play. Like, if you wanted to use them in just a regular deck, but you didn't want to use all of them, you know, just just put them in sleeves and your friends should be alright. Oh, and they all have a copy of the champion, the guy that uses them's autograph on them. Alright, we've also got Articuno. Waylord EX. One, two, two Jirachi EX. This deck actually cuts down on the amount of legendaries I need before I have a card of all of them. Two Shaman EX, which is the sky form, not land form, so it's less good. Floatstone. Two Execute. Mewtwo EX. Alright, so now all I need is Mega Mewtwo EX. Wait, what are you doing? Oh, this is the good Mewtwo. The one with X-Ball, nice. We've got two Archies, Ace, and the Hole. You can only play this card only when it's the last card. You can play this card only when it's the last card in your hand. Put a water Pokemon from your discard pile onto your bench, then draw five cards. That's not bad, considering all of this deck is more or less just water. Oh, we've got... Two more Keldeo EX. I didn't realize that. We've got two Professor Juniper. Discard your hand and draw seven cards. Yeah. Muscle Band. Four Battle Compressors. N. Dumbest name for a Pokemon character. Four Ultra Ball. Four Versus Seeker. Two Rough Seas. What does that even do? Oh. Alright. That's really good for water. It heals your water or electric Pokemon. Two Blastoise. Computer Search, Four Acrobike, Lysander, Four Trainers Mail, that's good for getting whatever you want out of your deck pretty much, Four Superior Energy Retrieval, That's not bad either. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
11 water energy. I honestly highly recommend getting this just for the fact that it comes with so many EX. Now, let's take a look in here and see what other decks were used in the tournament. Now, there's one that has Landorus EX as the main card. I already have him, so I chose not to get that. That deck list doesn't look so bad. The best things in it are Landorus Crobat and Lucario EX. That was used by the Junior Division Canadian first place. Second place was the Primal Groudon deck. I highly recommend getting that too, but only if you need the other cards in it too. Like I said, I only needed it for Primal Groudon, so I just, I didn't get it. Just, you know, it's cheaper to buy the single Primal Groudon than it is to do that. Alright, then third place for Junior Division used a Landorus deck as well, with Lucario in it. Dang, really? First and third used very similar decks. Fourth used a Seismitoad Manectric Mewtwo deck. Eh. First place for Senior Division used a similar deck to that. Seismitoad EX, Manectric EX, and Shaman EX are on that one. Second place Senior Division had no EXs. Good for him. Getting that far without one. Same for third place. Not very many Pokemon in these decks. More trainers than anything. Oh, fourth place should have won. He had Mega Manectric EX. And then there's the one we just talked about. And there's another Seismitoad deck. Apparently Seismitoad was popular. There's another Seismitoad. And then there's one that uses Mew EX, Shaman EX, Lampent, Punkaboo, and Jolting. I still recommend getting the Primal Groudon deck over that one. Oh, and it's got stuff about the video game championships, too. Looks like Champion from the Junior Division used Tyranitar, Amoongus, Thunderous, Landorus, Heatran, and Gardevoir. Senior Division, Cresselia, Landorus, Machamp, Charizard, Sylveon, and Heatran. Masters Division, Kangaskhan, Heatran, Thunderous, Landorus, Cresselia, and Amoongus. Alright. This was actually very interesting little booklet so yeah that's that's all for today and hopefully I'll be doing more Pokemon videos but I'm not really sure right now so you know just keep an eye out catch you later